So we got a while to go. Look at the system map. That's where we parked. This is where we're going. That's where it is. In there, apparently. Twenty-three and twenty-five. I've got a son who's twenty-two. I've got another son who is now twenty. Then I've got herself who's thirteen, and then I've got the other one who's ten. So I've got a broad spectrum of people who'll be able to look after me in my care home. It is a good point. It's a very good point. So I'm going to slow down here um, and we're going to do a little bit of scanning. Who doesn't like a little bit of scanning around you? Hmm? This is as boring as bloody hell, but it has to be done. Yeah, look, got a couple of worlds. Stands to reason what we got. Cluster three, cluster two, cluster one. It's cluster one we want. The ruse of Raxler is down here. I love these names. They're fab, innit? They? High metal content world. Because while I'm down here, I might as well think about doing some mining of materials, I suppose. That's got to be done at some stage, because all the materials that are going to be in Odyssey are going to be a right pain. Don't you think? Who else is going to be doing some mining of materials? I think there's going to be a good weekly stream assigned to this. And of course, we haven't been given a release date to Odyssey yet, have we? You know? Um, that's the thing. An icy body. Ah, the ex-wife shirt. Another icy body. Oh, needle plants. I'll have to do it and get us to go and do that. You know, I kind of got what I wanted, so, you know, um, we'll head to cluster one. That's what we want. Let's get cracking. Crystalline shards. Yeah, I know what you mean. That's a good screw getting all the way over there. Though from where I am at the moment, it's going to be hell of a poke. We should be able to engineer our fleet carriers. Oh yeah, well, that's the good thing about being on console. You've got a little bit of time to gather materials. Because that new DSS, well, they got to fix something there. There are their own mats there. There is, you're right, there's own materials there, but traditional materials, are they still going to be used for engineering? That's what we don't know, isn't it? You know? Okay, here we go. Are we there yet? The Perseus Dark Cluster. 
Lots of ships in the system. Oh yeah, they did. They did say it was bugged, mind. And they did slow everything down in regard to that scanner. Here we go. Here it is. Asteroids everywhere. It's had a bit of a kick in, isn't it? Look at that. Check it out. We've got big rents on the hull. Took me three jumps to get down here from where I was. And also, apparently, there's a dredger there as well. Look at that. Check it out. There it is. There's the asteroid destruction thing, sucking loads of stuff in. And there's the dredger. Yeah, well, we were sort of in the same location, weren't we? Right. Do you know what? I got a little condor. Let's get in the fight and have a zip round, shall we? Just look at that. It's huge. And if you look in, in there, and we've seen these before in season three, these massive grinders in there as well. But that is huge. Never mind the other ship. That'll be there. You know, watch him get too close. Yeah, I'll get sucked in the front. Won't be the first time. That's why I took the fighter and nothing else. You can see in there, put all that stuff in there, grinding up the asteroids. It is, it's, it's impressive, isn't it? Now, I think these are, these clans are going to be an entity in themselves. They're like generational ships, from what they're saying in Galnet. Um, you know, it's huge. You know, there's the other ship, and there's this one here, look. But it's been a while since I've seen one. So, it is... Impressive to say the least. Yeah, and it, it, it's something they've had in game for ages, right? You know, uh, and they haven't used. I don't know why. Obviously, now they're keeping it for a little bit of story. You can see all the stuff it's sucking up, look. Getting in there. That is something. But taking a, a bit of a nose around the side. Good to have a nose. You know, big old ship using artifacts as well. People try to feed stuff into it. Yeah, you know, hazmats, you know, some materials, ships. Uh, so that's obviously the business end down there. Let's get back into the ship. The 
looks like I've actually lost it. Where's it gone? The Scrivener's Clan Dredger. There we go. Let's get round the side. Let's see what's up here, round by the bridge section. So, I was right, everyone. That was a little bit of drama. Um, lots of drama with daughters, like I said. So, cut a long story short. Before I crash into, into this, let's put the anchors on. Um, where is LaveCon? I'll have to check it out. I quite fancy going. So what have we got here? So around the back, um, standard stuff. You know, we got some sort of engine here, wafting out stuff like that. Um, more engines wafting out stuff. It's quite impressive, isn't it? You know, Scriveners. I like that. Look at that. Scriveners. The Scriveners. With the Scriveners clan. Um, that is good. Jules, how you doing? Welcome up. Just standard elite dangerous today. Just for a little bit to see what's going on. We're on the back of this. This thing. Lots of guff. Look. From impacts. I think it's great. And we've got the symbol. Look, behold the symbol. The symbol of the Scriveners. Or is it the symbol of the dredgers? Dredgers. Who knows? You know, it's going to be quite interesting. So I think what we'll do, let's have a look um, and see if we can scan it. Um... We've got a composition scanner. We got any any targets here? Nothing. I'll have to get over here in the ship, I think. Give it a good scanning. It's an impressive model, you know. Woohoo! Oh, that thing can shift, can it? Um, right, okay. Let's get back to the ship. 
here be the ship let's give that an order not that we can we're gonna have to, we're gonna have to fly it in ourselves but i won't leave it i won't leave it here we'll, i'll go and get it um let's give it a scan Give it a bit of a scan. What have we got? We got ship uplinks, defense turrets, canisters. We can have a look at the uplinks as well. Let's um, fire some off, see what we got. Oh, I won't get a free pass. Yeah, it is. Well, at the moment it is. Yeah. Let's have a look at these um, uplinks. Of course, I've got a big old ship here. 2nd of July till Sunday, and that's the address. Pittsford Road. Uh, it'll all depend on what's happening with the pandemic, isn't it? And if people are going to be travelling, that sort of stuff. So here we go, let's get in there. That's log one. Where be log two? That be round the other side. You keep just changing your names. It's, it's ridiculous. <laughs> right. There's another one right there. Let's get in there. Brilliant. Um, where's zero? All the way over there, of course it is.
And then last one is number three. Ah, I've crashed. Okay, so what have we got then? Um, we've got the logs, number one. It says, fail. Manual intervention required. Data graphers or Thales report. Most files from the megaship's computer were uploaded without error, but this defied our archiving process. Upon further inspection, I found it to be encoded with a custom algorithm. And, and there's a message, look. That's there. Very good. Uh, so that's number one. Number two. This is the second file that has resisted automatic processing due to its coded structure. The encryption resembles that of VF, blah, 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 suggesting a common source, passing both files to Lecter General Caligore's department for further analysis. And then there's all this. Um, number three. This file was flagged due to its encrypted nature. Cross references found similar instances, but their encryption keys do not match. They found this from an internal drive in an empty EV suit. Very good. Looking at this. Hmm. And then number four. Manual intervention required. A second file from the same source as VF. Blah, 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 blah. Has been encrypted, preventing automatic transcription. And they've ordered all these files as well. And there's all these contents that they've got. Cool. All right, then. so that's that. Let's take a look at the other thing we've got floating around here, which happens to be the Hesperus. which is there. Let's take a good look over here. Can't do any of that. I haven't got any people on it. I'll have to go and fly it back um, before I get too far away. Let's go to the fighter. Right, where's my mothership? Here it is. Right. Here we are. These things are so fast. They are so fast. Um, right. Fighter retrieval sequence initiated. Incoming message. Fighter 
get it in the pipe. Whoever uh, misses, in the pipe, here we go. And we're in. Right, let's get over there and have a look. Okay, we've got it. Um, there's the app. Hackable data transmitters. I didn't bring any hackers with me, unfortunately. Not sure what I got on my carrier. Let's put the anchors on. Let's see what we've got. Ship epilogue. Uplink. Uh, might as well pick up some swag while we're out there. Yes, unfortunately, rich by rich by name, not by nature. Same year, mate. Same year. There it is. Gets a little bit closer. And then let's see what it's given us. Hesperus log. Emergency upload protocol engaged. And that's it. Well, there you go. This is the message for Commander Me. I represent the Tartarus Mining Ventures. We've been contracted by Salvation to collect the data you have gathered and recompense you. They're gonna give me two million for this or 10 units of Void Opals. Please dock at the Hind Mind in the Titori system and visit the mission board to collect your choice of rewards. Two million credits, two million spondaloonies. That's not bad. Or shall I have the void opals? Hmm, don't know. That's all right, isn't it? Will that pay for the tritium? No. <laughs> well, it, actually it might, it might pay for the tritium. Um, but you know, do a quick other, mm, probably two jumps. About that, wasn't it? Well, you're right, tritium is free if you mine it. Look at that, that's a picture, isn't it? Ooh, I like that. I may have to do I may have to do another video on this. Such a nice model. Some sort of solar paneling going on there. Venting something look into space. And then down here, you can see it's got, you know, it's had a hell of a lot of, hell of a good kick in. Big parts of it open to space. But still has power, look. Because the radar dish is going around. which is very interesting.
So yeah, a nice old model. Glad they came out here now, to be honest. And there's a few things to pick up as well, you know. Um, what's that on there? Not too sure. Let's go and have a look. So let's stick our nose in this, see what we can see first. Nothing much. Uh, did we pick anything up? There's still canisters knocking about. There was something white, or it might have been a reflection. Um, up here, what's this? That's some sort of, I don't know, repairable phone, do you reckon? Looks like, doesn't it? It's like it's, it's been sealed. A massive rent has been sealed in space. That's what that looks like to me. And we've got that all around this one particular section where there's been a bit of damage, been a bit of action. Space filler, yeah. It's exactly what it is. Good old repair foam, yeah. Expandable foam. And there we are, look, look at that. Good old dead engine. In the back. So yeah, there you have it. The Hesperus, everybody. All good stuff. Quite a good model as well, right? Quite a good model. And of course, I'm seeing these sort of things with the new graphics card as well. So it's, you know it's good. Right. Um... Have I picked any of this stuff up? No. Let's get over there then. Let's get up the other end. There they go. Picking up any jettison cargo. Suits me, sir. Every little helps, as they say at Tesco's. Oh, yeah, I'm going zip on over there. Pick up me two million. You know, um, that's a good earn. But look at that. The first 10 commanders will be separately and additionally reimbursed to the sum of 100 million credits. I'm off to hind my... <laughs> 
T Tory system. Right. Navigation. Let's go. Galaxy map. It's going to be about 15 jumps. You know? If I can get myself back to the old bloody, um, the carrier, and get myself there now. 15 jumps. Quicker to just jump it, isn't it? Let's go. Got a fuel scoop. Let's go, go, go. Right, where's my carrier? God knows. There it is. Let's go. I still like that dredge. You know, I think it's fab. And we're jumping. Let's get ourselves over there. Flippers down. So that was quite a nice little surprise. Let's face it, it's already been claimed, isn't it? You know. <sighs> Let's just look at that again. Oh, and down there, a hundred million credits. Woo! Yeah, well, I say I saw one about season three when they first came out and they were in some bizarre system and they looked good and we thought, ooh, what could that be? Yeah, next stage as well, look. It is interesting, the next stage. Come on, flippers down, let's go. <clears throat> so it really is like an in-game race when you think about it. And it's good that Frontier is still not just concentrating on Odyssey. They've realised that the PlayStation and Xbox commanders are still there, you know, until Odyssey gets released. So it is quite good. And we've all been so focused on Odyssey um, that we haven't bothered. A lot of people haven't bothered with the Hesperus. Um, where are we going? Carrier management. Uh, 
uh, where we go in T Tori okay let's find somewhere a good Let me see, about here? Nope. About there? Nope. There? Nope. There? Nope. There? Yep. Jump me there. Yeah, it's worthwhile, isn't it? Especially if there's money involved. Many, 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 baby. Go get that many, many, many. So say it'll be worthwhile hanging around in that area anyway. Yeah, you know, it is going to be worthwhile getting in on the start of this. You know, it's probably going to be something that carries on until the release of Odyssey. I wouldn't be a bit surprised. I mean, I've got, I've got another four days to wait until I can get my mining lasers. Got my ships parked there already. And it's nice to get back to the old game, isn't it? You know? Oh, that Sigma. Yeah, we did that community goal a couple of a couple of months back, didn't we? The Sigma. Sigma 6? Wasn't it? They got broken out or something from that one particular prison. Yeah, you're right. Uh, the NMLA. Okay, we are so flipper down here. This is... We're coming in. Theta 7. Ah, right, I see. Wonder how long they're gonna string this thing out for. Makes you wonder, doesn't it? But I got some good footage there for a video to go up on Monday, so that's good. And I put a video up today as well um, about the sampler. Of course, new PC. For some reason, I'd upgraded, uploaded it the first time in some format that meant. YouTube thought it was in 360 degree format, which it wasn't. But then I thought, hmm, 360 degree format, you say? I thought I could do some videos in that just for anyone who has a look at it on an Oculus. I might try one to see what it looks like. Just pop it up there. Oh, there, they're gonna string this out for ages. Absolute ages. They'll have people jumping left and right, up and down. Come on. Because I don't really want this leaving without me now, do I? Because that would be embarrassing, wouldn't it?
And I want to rename my ship as well. <laughs> Going towards that, it locks you out. Yeah, it's only a certain time when you can turn around and cancel uh, the jump, isn't it? Oh, it's happened to everyone. It really has. That would be absolutely ridiculous. Don't leave without me. Don't leave without me. <laughs> Leaving the handbrake off the caravan. <laughs> Oh, we're coming in, boys. Anchors, 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 anchors. Right. So you thought, no, you didn't crash. I didn't touch it. I did a little bit of super spinning. That's textbook landing, that is. Textbook landing, that is. That's what that is. And we're down. Resonator, how was work? <laughs> How's things going? Um, I fancy a different ship, you know. What ships have I got knocking about that I can just bomb about in? Um... I do like a federal assault ship, you know. But let's face it, I need something with jump range to get me up there. Probably the ship I've got is the best one for that at the moment. Yes, folks, it's time to wait for another jump. Ooh, curry. Is that like from a Mr. Indian curry or is that something you cooked yourself? I fancy a curry. I've had a bit of fast food today, this week, mind. I've had... The boy bought Domino's last night because he couldn't be bold to cook. So I had some of that. I might have had a McDonald's around about Tuesday. But that was a McMuffin, so that doesn't really count. That was breakfast. Oh, and I had fish and chips. So I come out the vaccination centre and bought fish and chips. Because you got it. Cause if they're going to put the vaccination centre right next to the chippy, what do they think is going to happen? Right? What do they think is going to happen in regards to that? Um, I'll tell you exactly what's going to happen. I'm going to go in there for a battered sausage, some chips, piece of fish for the old girl, you know, and a bit of curry sauce. That's what's going to happen. So what are we doing? So we've been down, we've seen that, that other ship, and now we're jumping to the T-Tory system to pick up the bounty, which was either 2 million credits, or if you're the first 10 commanders, which I won't be. A hundred million. But how many people have scrolled down? I wonder. Because I missed it the first time. And then you may be contacted for some of the mystery afterwards. You know? It's, it's compelling stuff, isn't it? If anything, we'll get up there and hand the bounty in. 
Oh, the Kerry guy. Yeah, he's all over YouTube, he is, isn't he? They're all cooking them in these ninja foodies and stuff. Ah. Let's have a look. The Kerry guy, he does Thai. The Kerry guy, easy curries. So which one, which, which book have you got? He's got the Kerry guy, recreate over a hundred best British Indian recipes at home and it's red. Right, or there's a blue one, a light blue one. I do like Thai curry. The missus doesn't though. So which book do you get then? Vegetable curry. <coughs> Excuse me. How's it going, fellas? The Red One is a good book. <sighs> ah, right. Man KG. Thanks for the follow. Let's add that to the basket. Get that bought. Cause he's got quite a good YouTube with that channel as well, hasn't he? Just arrived in the system. Yeah, the YouTube channel is really good. We'll wave as I leave. Yeah, we're not. What's happened? Yeah, I'm not back. I'm not in yet. So. Not sure if I'm playing in a. Am I playing in a multiple instance? I can't remember. I am in... Ooh, pending request. Look at this. Yep. More people are now in the group. I'm currently in solo, so... Uh... Oh, they're honking the horn. That's a good effect, isn't it? I love it. It's like, right in boys, we're off. Closing the doors. I'll go in and say to the missus, I've bought you a book. And she say, oh yeah. And I say, yeah. It's a good book. Now make me a curry. Yeah, I don't know if they'll let you walk around your carrier. It would be good to walk to the bridge and see these herbits that you've got. You're spending something like nine million a week on doing something, wouldn't it? You know, even they just sat at their stations. It'd be good to see them doing something for their money. But I don't think that'll be coming. That won't be coming in Odyssey. More than likely, yeah. So, yeah, ready to jump. Good to do a bit of scanning of the ship though, wouldn't it? And it's also good as well, because you know, it. see, Oddy's easy now for a lot of things could change on that before it gets released. And even though they said the release date is going to be in May. Really? Do we think it will be released in May? 
you're right. I think that would be a real quick win in regards to carriers. But like we were saying last night, there are so many other things that they could be doing in those stations, as opposed to just going into that one particular building. There's so much other stuff that could be done. Um, you know, battles raging through the station, which you've got to take part in. Why fly anywhere? Have a battle on a station. Station in contention. You could have commanders flying in, dropping down, you know, carrying troops in. Transport troops to this area. Join the fight yourself. You know, it's... What they can do is virtually limitless. It's what's on their roadmap, I think, is the issue. You're up. We're revving up. That would be something. I think that would really would be something. Oh, I should get out here. There should be two, three jumps to this one particular system. Come on, hyperspace, let me traverse you. I think they will. Um, I wonder how many people have pre-ordered it. Or have bought it and not bought the alpha access. Because you would have thought everyone would have gone for the alpha access, wouldn't you? Interesting to find out. I wonder if they'll release that. Alex, that's exactly right. I think shipboarding assaults would be great boarding parties. That's where we're going, fellas. Flip her down. Right, jumping. Jumpy, jumpy, jump, jump. Make the most of that hyperspace sequence too, because it's going. I do prefer the new hyperspace sequence as well. Go, 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 gadget arms. I find it ridiculous that some people stream exactly the same stuff that I'm streaming. Thousands of people watch. And there's only 20 of us. What's their secret? Does anybody know what their secret is? It's like there was like 2,000 people watching Down to Earth the other day. And you think, well, what? Really? Completely different league. I thought, I wonder if they're streaming to multiple platforms doing things like Restream, and that's where they're getting the additional followers. Yeah, could well be. The only person who talks to me is Yamex. And sometimes that's begrudgedly. <laughs> ha! 
<laughs> yeah, I think he went up and said, I'll buy it. And I'm done with it. Okay, here we go. We are in the Tatari system. Let's go scan the nav beacon. Oh, I, fantastic select crew, mate. It's, to be fair, right, I enjoy talking to all of you. And I haven't really been live streaming that long. So like just before Christmas, I've got my head back in the game. Yeah. I have no idea what a raid is, how you do it. Um, I haven't got a Scooby-Doo. Yeah, you don't, they, yeah, reciprocate. The only person I know is doing it as well, same time as me, is Rival. And no one watches his stuff. <laughs> For the best way it will in the world. Which is, it's a shame, because he's really good. Oh, I. Look at this. Someone wants to have a go. <laughs> right then. Yeah, he does. You're right. He does do um, Twitch streams. Come on in, type 10. Right. Now you're having it, mate. Having all the pack out. Yeah, don't like it up home, do they? Wasn't expecting that, was he? He dead it. He did. Quarter of a million there, and that's what they just said. Never mind what. I got a load of bounties to pick up there. Look at that. I got a bit of money to get rid of. So that's someone else having a go. Oh, give it up, like.
a little bit of excitement. But he wasn't expecting me to have many, many one, two, three, four, five pack hounds. But uh, there you go. Let's pick up all this swag. What we got swag wise? Ooh, materials. Let's have it all. Inventory. We want. Heat sink refill. Any clues about Raxler? Shame Steve-O's not on because he's our Raxler man. He won't tell you anything, but he's the one doing all the research. And so far, no. Unfortunately. Look at this, they made a right mess of my ship. Look at that. That's only like 10% damage. Big holes in it and everything. And to be fair, mostly that was caused by myself. Sent Lopez, thanks for the follow, dude. And a share. Absolutely fab. Yeah, good point, everyone. There's 18 of you. Hit, a, hit the like button on this. Give it a good smashing. Um, that would be great. I do like this model. I do like the damage on it as well. Do I stream other platforms? Facebook, YouTube, and Twitch. I think if Twitch found out I was doing YouTube and Facebook at the same time, they'd have an ad fit. Okay, let's um, seems that we are full of all that sort of stuff. Okay, cool. Um, and do jump. YouTube Ricardo's gaming, dude. Can't miss it. Same logo. Little spaceman. It's all kicking off here. Right, where are we going? Um, Hind Mine is where we're going. And look, it's one of those in an asteroid places. And I do like them. Now some cheeky monkey's more than likely going to pull me out of um, Super Cruise, but pff, whatever. Hey, good stuff. So, Hind Mine a station in an asteroid. I love them. There should be more of those dotted around. I think. Loads more of them dotted around. Yeah, I just don't get it. Thousands and thousands of people, right? You know, joining some of these streams, you think, hang on a minute. Um, 
How's that work then? And it's like you say, it's all about you know um, building communities and stuff like that. Pretty sure I've been here before. I've got some stuff to cash in. Look at all that money. Oh yeah, definitely being part of the community is the key. Though I think some of the people who are on um, the Elite Dangerous Community web page, that Pixel Bandits mob, they've certainly got their favourites. Lave Radio Space is great. You're right. There we go. In mine, is that going to be through those rings or just in front of it? I think it's going to be the other side, personally. I don't know. In mine, here we go, we're on approach. I know you can see some of the damage that caused on the module. Got so hot, blew itself apart. Here we go, we're going in. Jumping out. Here it is. Now it may look like just any old asteroid to you. But it isn't. And you can tell because you've got these little things poking up from there. But these bases are great. Can I dock? Landing permitted. Prep for arrival on landing pad three two. Can I dock, Chief? There it is. I think it's great. I think they're absolutely great. You know, look at all that detail outside. I think it's fab. Even, you know, without the new um, Odyssey graphics, it looks great. Right, let's get in. Hopefully I won't cock it up. Got all my lights on. I want pad 32. Here we go. It's that very sort of unfinished look to all these bases, isn't it? You know, it's I think it's great. The Eternal Cold. Thanks for the follow, dude. I mean, just look at that, you know? Loads of mischief going on. We all know these. 
Hands up in the chat. Who is sick of these things? If you've been playing Odyssey. Um, yeah, loads of things, you know, lying around. Lots of nice little artifacts. All rendered and hacked out of the... You own two of them. All good stuff. Look, and he's off. Right, anyway. On to the matter of and. What are we doing? Starport services. Here we are. Hind mine, everybody. So, mission board, wasn't it? Encrypted logs from the Hesperus. Complete mission. What shall I have? Ten void opal units. Don't know. What are void opals now these days? Let's see. What's a void opal going to these days? Elite. Dangerous. Void opal. Price. Uh, this is EDDB, mind. Five hundred and twenty-three thousand. So you're better off taking the void opals, isn't it? Uh, I mean, where am I? T Tauri, T T A U R I. That's it. Um, blah, 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 blah. I want to sell. Oh God, look at that. Four hundred and seventy-one light years away. There's someone buying him for four hundred and seventeen at hip two six. So it is a load of messing about. If you took him, you could make a little bit of money, I reckon. But generally, the price is not peaking above three hundred. But for some reason, I think we may need them. I don't need the many. I'll have the opals. There you are. There's my reward. Done. And that's good, isn't it? That's a new thing we're getting. Here. Oh, and there's lots of stuff to be, you know, you can donate all your money to them if you want to. Um, that's all good stuff. So there you go. That is that. Let's go on the contact. What have we got here? Uh, authority contact. Redeem all bounty vouchers. Oh, look at that, look. We've got, we've got a bit there. We earned from that fella. We'll have a bit of that. Um, power contact. I'm still waiting. And that is it, everybody. I'm going to sell my cartographic data. 611,000 credits for that. Well, I'll sell that as well. And then with that, all the credits start to mount up a little bit. Doesn't it? So, um, yeah, good stuff. Good stuff, good stuff, good stuff. So what we've got to do now is we just got to wait. Isn't it? That's all we got to do is wait. But do you wait at this station? Or do you go about your business? That, you see, is the question. That is the big question. And I've got to get all the way back to my carrier now. With... With those void opals. And therein lies the issue. Anyway, I'm going to knock it on the head today. Only a short stream. Got to see what the drama's going on in here. We'll be back on tomorrow, uh, tomorrow afternoon, and we'll do a little bit of Odyssey and see how that goes. But that was the Hesperus, uh, and that was getting all the way to Hind Mine. A little bit of Pack Hounds as well, going off. Got a bit of Pack Hounds. Took that Type 10 right out, didn't I? Um, and we also looked at the Dredger. 
So, all good stuff. Really envoy, uh, enjoyed your company uh, in the stream. Fly safe, everybody, and have a good look. Um, unfortunately, it seems that the 100 million credit bounty for the information on the Hesperus has already been claimed. So, as 10 lucky commanders have got that. And we'll pick this up again tomorrow. Take it easy. Stay safe. Don't get lost or killed. See you soon.